Okay, capture one styles. Let's get to it. Okay, so I'm not gonna waste your time in this video, but first I do have to explain what a preset or a style is for the people who may not know. A preset or a style, as Capture One calls it, is a group of predefined settings to help edit your photos and speed up your workflow. And there are many reasons as to why you would wanna create your own. For example, I have clients that want the same look for every one of their shoots, or for my own personal images. I have colors that I don't like, and I wanna take those out every time. Now that we got that out of the way, let's get into Capture One. Okay, so here we are in Capture One 22. To start out, the tab you want to be in is this one here. I don't know what the name of it is, but that's where you want to be. You want to go down to this plus icon here and do new field adjustment layer. I'll tell you why you should do your presets or styles on an adjustment layer later in this video. So to start out, we're just going to create some minor adjustments or some simple tweaks to this particular photo. We're going to raise the blacks, drop the whites, drop the shadows, uh, lower the highlights a little bit. Uh, saturation down brightness lower the contrast and then one more thing I like to do to my images is take out the blues I really don't like the blues at all let's go back raise the blacks just a little bit more and that's it for this particular shot so let's say we want to save these settings as a particular preset so I can use these on future images what you want to do is go to your adjustment layer up here right click it and then save adjustments as style when you click on this uh, a box or icon is going to come up it's going to give you uh, all of the settings that you just tweaked like contrast brightness saturation all of those things that you made adjustments to and it gives you the option to click them or unclick them so if you want to save all of these settings as a new preset or style what you do is hit save and then you name it let's just name it the Trevon spell today then you hit save so once you do this that particular adjustment is going to come to this tab here so you're going to show styles and presets custom and then your new one should be right here so let's go back and delete this adjustment layer go create a new adjustment layer do field again so no settings are here but if i go here I can apply adjustments from custom styles. Detroit. The reason you want to do it this way is when you add that a preset to an adjustment layer, you can change the opacity. So I can put it all the way on 100% or I can just do halfway. So the same thing for this particular image over here, image of myself again, what you do is new field adjustment layer. apply adjustments from custom styles detravon again and then there you have it the preset is already saved another way to do this without adding the adjustment layers let's reset this is to just come here to this tab and you can just click on that particular preset and it's automatically applied the reason i don't like doing it this way is that you cannot control the opacity of that preset or the intensity of that preset so the way that I advise that you do it is the same way that we did it previously. So let's clear that one out and go to field adjustment layer all over again. Right click it, apply adjustments from boom. And there you have it. I hope they gave you a good understanding of how to create a preset or a style in Capture One. If you have any other questions or something that you want to add, just drop those below in the comments.